All right, boys, welcome to Kingdom 12 After Hours, where we play whatever the hell we freaking want. AKA not racing games. So look, if you know of Octopath Traveler, you know how great of a game it was. So uh, we're gonna play the second one, because why not? I think first though, we're gonna change some settings here. Too fast on that. And we're good with that. Who we got here, man? Scholar Oswald. Gain information from townspeople, gain insight into a foe's weak points at the start of battle. Your name is Oswald V. Van Steen. You are a scholar. Your tale begins in the snow-swept reaches of the Winterland. You have been sentenced to life in prison for murdering your wife and daughter? What? <laughs> what? It has spent, since spent, 1,879 days locked within a frigid... <laughs> who kills their wife and daughter? Harvey, the man who took everything from me shall die by my hand, I swear. Oh. Maybe he was framed? Not even the bitter cold can extinguish the raging fire in your breast, and so you set out to exact your revenge. Each time. Whoa. That out. Huh. Bring townspeople wherever you may go. Moonlight judgment. Inflict all foes with enfeebling effects at night. Your name is Temenos Mistral, and you are a cleric. Your tale begins in the mountainous region of the Crestlands. Though easygoing in your duties as Inquisitor, that all changes the day a tragic incident takes place in the church. Oh dear, I suppose it can't be helped. After all, doubt is what I do. Since there is much more to the incident than meets the eye, you set out to solve the mystery left in its wake. Alright. Ooh, 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 who's that? Actually, that bat. <laughs> Ambush. Knock townspeople unconscious. Deep throne. Leave no trace. Act twice in a single turn. Your name is Throne Anguis, and you are a thief. Your tale begins in a thrilling city in the Brightlands. You are a member of the Black Snakes, a thieves' guild that controls the city from the shadows. Your job is to steal and clean. Not again, not the stench. Every time I breathe in it, it feels as though my very lungs are rotting the stench of blood. Determined to escape the cycle of bloodshed, you embark on a journey for the keys to freedom. Alright. Hunter, oh shit. <laughs> oh shit. Uh, befriend, bring townspeople wherever you may go. Animal instincts let your inner beast loose and gain access to special skills. Your name is Oshit. 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 <laughs> and you are a hunter. Your tale begins on the Isle of Totohaha, alongside your fellow beastlings. Despite your troubles with the human islanders, you live a carefree life that is until you learn of an encroaching calamity known as the Night of the Scarlet Moon. All right, Master Juva, I'll do it. I'll find those creatures of legend and bring them back. Oh, six. Desperate to save your home, you set sail in search of those who can help. Alright. Anything down here? Look at this. Pockery Akasti. Obtain information from townspeople. Use materials to craft healing and hazardous compounds. He's carrying a little boy. Up a grandma. Your name is Casti Florenz, and you are an apocryphal. Your tale begins in a port town of the harborlands. Discovered adrift at sea, you will work to the realization that you cannot recall your own name. The only clues to your identity are your satchel and skills as an apothecary. I need to rediscover who I am. And there's something else, something important I'm forgetting. Unable to ignore the nagging feeling within you, embark on a journey to recover what you lost. Who this guy? Merchant Articio. Bring townspeople wherever you go. Hoot and holler. Replenish all your BP in an instant. <laughs> He's got a fedora. He has a baller. Look at him. What a what a what a sw ah. Anyway, your name is Articio Yellowwill. You are a merchant. Your tale begins in the vast wastes of the wildlands. After witnessing the rise and fall of the pioneer town you call home. Set your gaze upon the horizon. I'll be back once I eliminate that devil called poverty from the world. 
If you need to bring prosperity to all, you embark on a journey with only the scent of commerce to guide you. Okay. Who is Dancer Agnia. Entreat. Obtain items from townspeople all together now. Extend the reach of skills to all. Your name is Agnia Bristarni. You are a dancer. Your tail begins in the verdant region of the Leaflands. Though a tavern dancer in a small village, you have big dreams for the future. I'm going to become a star and bring smiles to people's faces just like Mama. With hope in your heart and a spring in your step, you begin your journey to stardom. Okay, interesting. Oh, hell yeah. Warrior Gari. Engage in battle with townspeople? <laughs> Jesus. Master skills during challenges and use them in battle. Oh, wait. So with the... What's... Okay, I didn't notice that. When you change from day to night... Okay. Latent power. Okay, it's, it just goes over more information. But at night, he can obtain information from townspeople. His latent power is... Shadows hold unleash the darkness within to gain access to special skills. Huh. Your name is Akari and you're a warrior. Your tale begins in the desert region of Hinoma. You are the younger prince of Kut, a nation ever at war, and warrior for your people who have suffered greatly from the ceaseless battles. I pray for a world without conflict, without bloodshed, hoping to bring peace to your nation. You strike out on a journey for your like minded allies. Is that eight? Three, four. Five, six, seven, that was eight. These characters don't really stand out to me like the first one did, honestly. I mean, who do we want to start with? I'm gonna go with the merchant, this dude, merchant. Let's go with this dude. Local for a business partner? <laughs> 16 years ago. Freaking Wild Arms 3 over here. <sighs> what do you think, Particio? What do we do with this land? What do you mean, what? Mary Scratch here. That's exactly why I'm asking, little chickadee. It's a blank slate. It can be whatever we make of it. Long as we got the skill and gumption, anyhow. Gumption. Wow, Pops. You sure got away with words. I know, son. Swipe that line if you want. Swipe that line. No, I won't do that. Even ain't right. Real merchant doesn't filch with them. They buy it. That's my boy. Fine words. You do me proud. Oh, ooh, I had an idea. It was up to me. That's with this whole plot with all our friends. And that way, we could all settle it together. <laughs> I like how you think, Chickadee. That'd make everyone happier than hens in a coop. Yeah! Smart, huh? <laughs> Fine idea. But we can't forget our business interests here. This land is an asset. We bought the deed to it fair and square from its former owner. If we want to divvy it up, Patricio. Aw, come on now. Yeah, don't be stingy. We're here because we heard there was silver to be found. In. Rock and I pooled our money and bought the rights. That we did. <laughs> Rumor was you couldn't take a step without tripping over. 
This is no time to be oohing and on, Chickadee. Ooh and on. You want to be a merchant too, right? That's the idea. Then take these leaves and go buy us some silk. Gosh, I don't know if I'm. Get on, Chickadee. Cultivates a discerning eye through knowledge and experience. That means hands-on training is more precious than gold. Yes, sir, Mr. Rock. I'll go buy some silver then. Licking spoiled boy. Uh, negotiate a good price and show us your business acumen. Move character. Add the action main menu, cancel, dash, confirm, select. Change of counting enemies is higher while dashing. You jump? No? Yeah, show us your business. Yeah, who's got silver? Oh! I thought we were the dude in the top left. We're the we're the kid, huh? Huh. Would you look at that? Would you freaking what you call it? Okay. Must have sufficient funds. Alright. Hello? Herb of healing. You got anything, lady? Good one, huh? Oh. Uh, go on, boy. Go on, boy. What is? What you got? Oh, we're getting a grape. We're getting a plum. We're gonna spend all that money. Yeah. I'm a merchant kid. Stone. Why not? It's only a freaking whatever that currency is. Leaves? Is that what that said? Leaves? Tree nut. About the nut. <laughs> yeah, boy. Got light coin pack. buying everything. This is dude. Get away from me, you brat. I don't think so. Give me that stone and give me that dubious silver nugget. Dark stone of unknown composition. There it is. Some mighty fine metal. Port back to pops. Is there something up here? What's this? Can we get that? Can't go out there? Alright, that's fine. I don't want to go out there anyway, you know? Go Pops. Hey there, Particio. Managed to buy any silver? Yeah. Sure did. Here. Give it. Whoa. I bet we can earn a bundle off this. Good one. We sold off all but a roof over our head to start this business. Mm. The global economy is beginning to adopt a standardized silver leaf to service. We're entering the age of silver. Mark my words. Age of silver. We're well positioned to earn a fortune. Right. We rise and shine early tomorrow to get digging for- Get digging a little boy. <laughs> Slave labor. Child labor. <laughs> He's all excited. I'll make you money, Dad. We're now I won't get any. Rocket rich, chickadee. Chickadee. There we go. Oh, shit.
Well, there it is. A fancy little house. Eight years. It took eight years to build that house. No way. They they probably built it like a couple months and then it was like it's time passed. There's no way. I got like a whole town going on. Well, would you? It's a wild, wild west out here, man. Hey, yo, step right up. Hey, that's us. We're not a little boy anymore. Today's haul, freshly plucked from the salt, 100% pure, high quality ore. Ooh. Rumors about the quality of this town's silver. Yeah. Buy some. What real guarantee can a youngling like you offer? Hey, looks can be deceiving, my fine friend. I've been doing this for eight years now. Eight and I years. know my stuff. I've been doing it since I was a little kid. It's the only means by which you can assess silver's hoard quality. Take a look at the sheen on this rock. See the luster? Uh, and the sparkle? What this is the finest you'll find in the what? land. It's even used in old King Dudley's crown. Impressive. King Dudley. It starts at 10,000 leaves. Jesus. Let me hear some numbers. 400,000 leaves. Jesus. 800,000. 1,600,000. Ooh, Granny got deep pockets. Ah, 1,800,000 leaves. We've got 1.8. Any other bidders? So for 1,800,000. We should be like, we should have some good money coming out of here. Go right? on, take it. Go Don't on. Regret this. Hmm. I hear these merchants built this silver operation themselves. In just eight years, they turned this town into one of the continent's most plentiful sources of silver. That young lady's got potential. He possesses a discerning eye. Damn right, I do. But more than that, he's deft at reading people's hearts. I'm already a merchant. He's only 16, too. Soon he'll be a force to be reckoned with. <laughs> On to our next nugget. Let's get the bidding started. Continue the story with the green uh, icon. If you're too far, continue to the destination marker, and then your icon will be displayed. Side story, starting point, save point, hidden item, other, exit, area. First, I want to turn radar off. We got earnings. Uh, uh. What's the start button do? Nothing? Okay. World map? Or it? Or's rush? Wildlands. Okay. No, 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 no. Okay, just because, you know, what we've done. Do we still have everything we bought? We do. Okay, we got a spear, a hand, but handmade bow, wooden shield, ordinary hat, tough beast, coat. Alright. He's got a spear healing with oh. oh, mm -hmm. Pretty good HP for, uh, what are we, like level one, I would assume? Yeah, level one. Plus 11 on the attack? Yeah, we're gonna get that. Thank you. Um, <laughs> so... Can we sell to these people? No, we can't buy it from them. Not everybody says something. Ain't nothing for me to do there. 
You can only talk to the people to save. Or not to save icons, a little text speech. Well, I guess we're going in the freaking weapon shop. Thousand. Ooh. We got some good, uh. Let's sell. A little bow. It doesn't fetch for like anything, but um lump of silver. I don't know if we wanna sell that already. Or sell that. Chill on the rest. Yeah, they got some good stuff here. Yeah. We got that for a good price, four hundred. Ooh. Guys are doing that much damage already? Can he actually equip that stuff? I guess so. Alright. Yep. Yeah, give him a good life, my dude. Nope. to rest. We don't need to rest. Mom for the day, son? Is that mom? Never grab these, dude. You never know when you're gonna need them. Oh. Look at that. Where are you going? Okay, I got cloth hood. I don't know if that's any better. What roll of we got? And I'm gonna wanna like check everybody. Okay. Go this way. Yeah. I don't even know why I'm checking. I don't really have money. Did I wanna go this way? I'll leave. Any items over here? I feel like we should be finding some items. You know? Go see dad up on the hill. Check around first, no? Okay. Hey, bud. Hey there, pops. I sold a bunch. That's my. My boy. Chicken D. <laughs> You've grown since we settled here. But yeah, it's been eight years. We're only gonna keep on growing, Pops. You bet. Just gotta keep on digging up more. And of course, use the profits to do right. To do right. You bet you, Pops. Artisio. Artisio. We've got trouble. That gang's stirring up mischief at the mine. Uh oh. They're back, huh? Go on ahead. I'll catch up. Go on. Go on, get. I love. We're about to try that new bow, boys. Protecting our mines vital, but keep the violence. No. Kill them all. That's a deal I can't make, Pops. Deal I can't make, Pops. I'm gonna go rouse the town. Yeah, I'm gonna go rouse them up. Whoever's willing to come. Hell yeah. Hey, but 
Just don't do anything risky, you hear? Hi. <laughs> Little 16 year old Particia is about to Damn, boy. whoop some ass. Already gone. Damn, boy! <laughs> Hell yeah. Yeah. At night, Particia can hire townspeople into following him. Mm, okay. this guy a peddler I don't know enough to hire him What's that doing? takes our more oh my god what if I don't have money that I hire anybody Is like 300 like the minimum? Oh, bro. Have an idea. We're gonna have to sell our lump of silver. Gonna have to. It just needs to be done. Oh, so we can get some people. This guy's strong? 600, right? Physical boost. Oh, we just do one dude. All right. We hire more. Oh no. Okay, so one at a time. Got it. Go to the mines, man. Got like yeah, six hundred bucks. I'm in. All right, boys. Here's the deal. We're going we're gonna to cut this episode here, come back, and we'll, uh, this is going to be a long game, you know, but it's a good one. So I'll see you boys on the next one.